Any that work for the Royal African Company. You don't mean to traffic human cargo now, do you? No, Jesus, Addy. You know me better than that. We're only after information. Looking to find where the princess docks in her spare time. The princess? Slave ship. Right. Blackbeard told me there's a good chance we'd find the sage aboard. We must translate me! These waters are well guarded, sir! Just sunk a merchant schooner. Damn. Can't that animal stay the course we agreed to? Surely we are nearing our goal. Don't sink that slaver ship, can we? There's hundreds of innocent men aboard. I know, I know. Press me there, sir! Harpoon it, get out! She's spooked, Captain! The slaver ship is running! Damn fool! I'll get us in close. that Captain Vane. He's unloading everything he has. He'll sink it if he's not careful. We'll get closer. Fire! 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 Oh, 
We're going over. Find the captain. Come on, me, Roxanne. You scare me back in brain. Guns and steel aren't louder than sticks and spittle, though. I've more than enough of all that. Just find the captain. Captain claims the princess sails out of Kingston every few months. All right. What's that cost? Go made ash of my sails and rigging jackanapes. You owe me a share. Oh! Oh, damn it, Vane! Oh, Charles, what a surly devil you are. Don't fuck with me, Jack. Oh, but it's my mandate to fuck with you, Charles. Oh. Lads? Ah, see, oh. the boys and I had a bit of counsel while you were wasting time with this lot. And, um, well, they figured I'd be a fitter captain than you reckless dogs. I'll cut you another cut, Tracer! <laughs> this one I figure I might sell for a tenner down in Kingston, but uh, with you two grog blossoms, I can't take any chances. You regret this day, Rackham. I regret most of them already. Tie them up! Cast them off. I'll gut you, Jack Rackham! I'll open you up! I'll tear out your organs and slay your bloody loot with them! Stop your goddamn howling vein! There's no bloody use! Well, well! The face of our good Kenway speaks, eh? Pray tell us, Captain, how to quit this predicament. And tell us what genius you have for sailing a boat with no sails and no rudder! Shut your gob! Now. I'll take these oysters you've ordered. You mad sap. This island's crawling with food if only you'd care to look for it. Yeah, I am looking, louse. Found some just here. <laughs> don't! Don't come following now. Do you hear me? Don't come looking for me. Ratchet fool.
thing thing the fact that I'm the well thing come let us drink it while we have breath but there's no drinking after death and he that will his health deny down among the dead down among the dead down, 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 down among the dead men, let him lie. Don't dance with the fishermen and their dories, Kenway! This island's mine! Come at me and I'll cap you, bastard! It was your bloody imagination that landed us here, Kenway! I'll be damned if I let that mine make one more decision for me! Will you not talk to me, Vane? Are you fixed on this madness? Madness? <laughs> Nothing mad about a man fighting to survive, is there? I mean you no harm, you corker. Now let's work this out like gentlemen. Oh, God. I've got a bleeding headache on account of your jabbering. Now stay back and let me live in peace. I would if you stop filching the food I gather and the water I find. I'll stop nothing till you bait me back in blood. You was the reason we were out looking for slavers. And you was the reason Jack Rackham took my crew. I said not to follow! Jesus, you've lost your head, man! It's a fair exchange for finding these flintlocks and grenados. Listen, Vane. We can hunt with those guns. <laughs> and I mean to! I'll blow you to hell! Bloody rags will be all that's left of you, Kenway! No escaping me!
You and your bloody fairy stories got us into this mess, can we? And I'll be damned if I let you drag me into another. You keep this up, and I'll have to kill you, Vane. Bloody try, by all means. It's either you or me who's leaving this island alive, Welcher! Because I'm not going to sail again in a world cursed by your ugly mug! Boy, you only done half a fucking job. Fucking hell. Is this my reward for believing the best about men? For thinking that a bilge rat like you could muster up some fucking sense once in a while? Maybe Horner Gold was right. Maybe the world does need men of ambition to stop the likes of you from mucking it all up. <laughs> or maybe. You just don't have the stones to live with no regrets. <laughs> don't save me a spot in hell, Shanker. I ain't coming soon. Fishing schooner single handed. Damn canny, Captain. 
as is taking back my break from this pillock. Once again, I thank you both. This Billy Huff didn't last two months with your ship before he came limping back to Nassau. Took the pardon straight away. I had to, lads. That Rogers was on to me from the first. Hold your tongue, Rackham. So what now? Still chasing your elusive fortune? Aye, and I'm close. I've heard the sage is sailing out of Kingston on a ship called the Princess. Put your ambition to better use, can we? Find the sage with us. I've no stomach for you and your mystics, Mary. I want a taste of the good life. An easy life. No one honest has an easy life, Edward. And it's aching for one that causes the most pain. All right, Rackham. Back to retirement. Must win. 